Because how far did he get? <laughs> Jameson, where are you going? Good morning, guys. It's actually not morning, though. It's afternoon. Sarah and I spent the majority of our morning actually trying to finish up the nursery and get that put together. We're really wanting it to be done soon so we guys, so we can go ahead and show you guys do the nursery tour and make it very nice and neat. We're just waiting on a couple more things. We rearranged all the furniture today so it's, everything's where it's supposed to be. And now Jameson's down for his first nap and Sarah's down for her first nap. Doctor's orders. She has to nap. But now that we're not in the nursery, I can go ahead and vlog and I can, you know, say good, good morning to you guys even though it's not morning. But one thing that we are wanting to do today, since it's so lush and green outside, is we're going to try to take some maternity photos for Sarah that we can, you know, upload and have. But we might wait till later this evening because it is really, really hot. And, you know, forecast shows that that's not going to change anytime soon. And it's been that way for like a good few weeks now. So we're probably going to try to wait till closer to evening time when the, you know, the sun starts to go down a little bit. Plus, if, you know, the sunset tonight's anything like last night, it'll be, you know, like a natural filter. We won't even need to, you know, do anything fun with that. It's just a great, great light. Alright guys, I don't know if you can tell by me squinting or the brightness of this video, but it is hot. Look at the sun. Don't look at the sun. It's bad to look at the sun. Uh, but yeah, it is very, very hot outside. And I've got to put these things in the car there's a car seat and then the other stroller piece you know so that we could put two babies in the same stroller but it is super duper hot out here uh, all right let's see if it all fits in the trunk of our crv that's the car seat adapter that's for baby number two baby number one is still attached to the stroller and voila. Oh, it's too big. Well, naturally, we'll have to do this differently then. Yeah. In case you don't know, it's super hot out here. No, doesn't fit in here either. Because the contents of the box do fit in the car, but the box does not. Yeah, see that fits much better. I'll just set it like that. Well. That's kind of what it's gonna look like. But I'm just gonna leave it like that for now. For the record, it is super freaking hot outside. Like, oh, M, J, hot. Well, what's the verdict? Do you have to use a pot? I have to use a pot. I can't find my mixing bowls. I know where it is, but I can't go get it right now. Oh, okay. Baby's asleep. That baby is asleep. Everybody's sleeping, but us, that's not fair. So, that's to not make noise. I can't go get the other mixing bowl. It actually has a, a few of my tools in it. Um, this is not my most desirable feature, but uh, I forget things sometimes. And I use that bowl to organize screws and, you know, tools and stuff when we built these bookshelves, which was a long time ago. And that bowl has not made it back to the kitchen since. So now Sarah's using a pot to mix the biscuit mix in for the biscuits and gravy we're having for dinner. Yeah, we're trying. And for the, uh, you know, I don't, I don't, I'm not trying to make a mean joke here. It's not a mean joke, it's just a joke, but Lydia, yes, our biscuits are from a box mix. I cook a lot from scratch, but um, <laughs> not when I'm pregnant. I'm not doing Scratch that. stuff is, yeah, we do it all the time. Everybody here does it all the time. Especially around the holidays. But box mixes. Now dinners, I still make them scratch. Box mixes are just they're, they're cheap. They're they're already mixed up. They're not they're, they're not expensive, and you just. Yeah. So they're easy for me. I don't care if they're. I mean, scratch is no more expensive than box. 
Wait, 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 wait. What was that? I said for me, it's just that they're simple to do. Scratch mix is actually cheaper than buying a box mix because like a bag of flour is like three bucks. This is true. Whereas a cake mix is like 250. Yeah. But like I said, it's just, it's the ease of use. So, Jameson got mad at me while we were eating dinner because I was drinking, you know, some soda with my dinner and I had a drink. So we decided to get him a drink himself. And I want you to see what he does. <laughs> Show him. Throw it back. Oh yeah, Thirsty Thursdays. Let's see if we can get a close up. Oh my god, he's so cute. Yeah! All right, we made it to the park. We did. We are going to take some shots with the camera. This guy all dressed up. Look at those shoes. Mama looks amazing. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. You know what? I clean up nice too. A little cocky. A little cocky. I'm but sorry. It is true. You ready to take some pictures? You clean up so stinking nice too. You ready to take some pictures? Not even two minutes in, we already hit a snag. I saved all the pictures, the poses I wanted on my phone, and then I was like, you know what? I don't need to bring my phone. So Robert has to run back to the house. Luckily, it's like a football field away. But he has to chill. And look at my face. I've been out here like five minutes, and I'm already like stinking red. Hopefully, I remember how to use the editor to edit some of this out. <laughs> have to be quick. Because how far did he get? <laughs> Jameson, where are you going? Come here, come here. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Whoa! Can you go, can you not just go stay with mom? You are drooling. All right, let's see. No, you gotta stay with mama. Stay with mama, come here, no, 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 no. No. Let's try to line the shot up. Hope we're gonna have to move. First things first, we take off the fish eye. <laughs> Look at you. That was actually kind of a waste of time. <laughs> I think we maybe got three, two or three good pictures maybe. We got to do four poses maybe. It was thundering in the back, in the distance. There were bugs everywhere, mosquitoes were eating us alive and it was too hot and James was just everywhere. So we just ended up coming home. And so now we're hanging out. Don't mind my rebozo that back there. I had to make like a homemade rebozo out of a piece of fabric I had because the sheet just wasn't cutting it. Also, I am filming in the nursery, which sort of gives away that we rearranged a little bit, but I think it's okay. Jameson, watch daddy. Watch. Hey. Jameson, watch daddy. Look at these ones. Are you gonna get him? He's gonna get him. He's gonna try to. You gotta put one down to grab the other. No, you like the purple one? You Don't like that purple it. one? Don't, Don't put it in your it. mouth. Don't. No, sir. It is late now. Jameson has gone to bed, and it's hard to say how our pictures will turn out. Um, you know, it started to storm, and there were like, you know, bugs everywhere, and we were just like, let's go in. So. We'll see how those turn out. But now that everybody's going down to bed, I don't know. Sarah's getting ice cream. Her lovely dad, who's really old, is helping us. Mm. But yeah, that should be plenty. Sure, you want more? Ah, uh, one little more scoop. Really one. old, thank you for that. He is really old. He's, in fact, he's so old that he was watching a whole Leonard Skinner co concert on the classic VH1, which will even no longer be VH1. Starting at, tomorrow. After today. Yep, today's the last day. And then he also gave me the whole lesson on Leonard Skinner and how only one of them was the original members. And Who's how. Left? Say what? Who's left? Oh, I don't remember. 
Yeah. No, no, I'm saying he's the last yeah. of the original. Yeah, he's the last of the original Gary ones Robinson. left. Yeah. Which, I like Leonard Skinner, don't get me wrong. But I did not know all that about them because I wasn't alive then because you're super old. That's right. How was your ice cream? It was good. I'm still hungry. It wasn't enough. It's not enough, Dad. The bowl is on the bed. The empty bowl is on the bed. The empty hangers are still on the bed. Touche. I'm hungry. What do you want? Jambalaya. You got some jambalaya? We got some jambalaya. I shall go get her some jambalaya. Fresh jambalaya. I don't know what I had to do to get this. <laughs> don't don't do that. Stop it. What was that? My shirt. So, how many people did you flash to get my jambalaya? Just one. A guy named Zadaran. How was that uh, jambalaya that I went to New Orleans to get? New Orleans. New Orleans. It was very good. Did you like it? I did, but I think Bliss is getting ready to break through our door. Ah. Uh, well, send your regards to Mr. Zataran. Thank you, Mr. Zataran. <laughs> it's, it's time for subscriber, subscriber shout out. Tonight's subscriber shout out goes huh? to. Ba -ba 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 that is so bright. Lucy loves Pampered Chef. Lucy says, Woohoo, go Jameson. I have just over 11 months between my eldest two. One on the 27th of December, and the next on the 7th of December, the next year. They shared their first Christmas. Do you hear the thunder? Did you hear the thunder? It was big. Anyhow, Callum, I hope I pronounced that right, Lucy, walked into the hospital to see his new baby sister. I wonder if Jameson will be walking in to meet Finn. That would be so cute. He I might would, be. I would really like to think that he would be. He is, like, he even, like, tonight... Before he went to bed, he went to play with his little cars on his shelf, and he like picked the car up, and he just chose to stand there by himself and look at his car, and then put it back. Like he chose to let go of the shelf and just stand. It seems like he will be walking within, you know, five, four or five weeks. But I will say that when Jameson hits a milestone, he's away. He typically hangs out there for a few months. Um, like with crawling, he army crawled for a couple months and then he started crawling, crawling. Then he just opened up, well actually I think it was about a month. Maybe a month, but he, he definitely like likes, he's very cautious, he likes to know that he can do what he's going to try to yeah, do. Yeah, it might be a month before he's got the courage to actually just take some steps. Yeah, but I do think it's awesome that your, um, your oldest two kids got to share their first Christmas, even though they oh, weren't God, born yeah, at the that same is time. Awesome. It's pretty incredible. Like, the thought of it blew my mind when I first read that comment. Mm -hmm. And I was like, well, wait, if they're not exactly... Did you hear that one? Yeah. That's probably what woke him. Probably. So we better hurry. But I was sitting there thinking, I said, well, what, like, first experience are they actually going to be able to share? Because there's not really a holiday between their birthdays. Or between his birthday and when Finnegan might be born. Probably Halloween. Probably our Halloween special. Well, Jameson has had a Halloween. What, first experience? The only one I can think of is Jameson's birthday. Yeah, and that's only if they, he comes on time. But yeah, that's only if Finnegan comes on time. But that is going to be it for today's vlog. So if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment. And follow us on some social media. And we love you guys. We do. We hope you have a wonderful day. Bye! Bye.